am I not supporting you? And I said, did you not get scarred out? Interesting. Had nothing to do with me. <laughs> Hey beautiful, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, my name is Alexa Jada and welcome. Today we're gonna be doing a mukbang and a sore time. I'm so excited. Mmm. Can y'all guess what we got? Do I gotta raise it up a little bit? Because <laughs> last time I didn't have it in the shot, you guys were like, it's a mukbang but we can't see the food. You're right, you're right. They gave me two pairs of gloves, like if I'm sharing. Can y'all see? Oh, I was about to get so mad. I was like, they didn't put a sausage in there. The sausage, they like, didn't even cook it right. Oh, God. Oh, well. Mm. Mm. This is not a lot. I remember it being a lot. I'm going to have to watch my other one because this doesn't look like that's a lot. I honestly feel like I've been, been been boozled, you guys. Like, I usually have more shrimp than this. This is not enough shrimp. Okay, so grab your snack, sit down, let's chill. If you don't like mukbangs, I'm so sorry. I'll meet you in another story time. But for this story time, we're doing a mukbang. Cheers. That is so good. Mm. <laughs> Story time on my makeup client. Sometimes when I have like free time or when I can, I will do makeup on clients. Sometimes someone will message me and it'll just be like the timing was right. And like, oh yeah, like I can. Like, yeah, that's great. Like I can. I have a friend and we've been, uh, well, I had a friend. We were like cordial for quite some time. Happy birthday, happy birthday. See you here, see you there. And we'll have coffee sometimes. Mm -hmm. She'd always tell me like, how come you don't do clients? You definitely should do it. We would both do clients sometimes. And I would tell her like, oh yeah, like, I did this and she'd be like, oh yeah, like me too. I didn't think anything of it. I was like, cool, we both doing it. I would even send her people when I couldn't and I'd be like, oh, here's my friend. No like competition on my side. I love that for you. I love that for you. Let's both make money. When she would refer somebody, I didn't like that she would tell them, oh, let her know I sent you. She'll probably throw in a freebie. Freebie what? What are you talking about? <clears throat> A corn extra good. So one time she sent somebody, she couldn't do it. And she was like, please, Alexa, please. I have this appointment, totally forgot about it. I don't want to have to reschedule her or anything like that it's a really important day for her can you please do it i was like yeah for sure now when i would refer a client i would tell her like here's a deposit that they gave me yada 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 you know but when she would do it she'd be like oh i'll take you out to coffee i'll take you out here i'll take you out there which is no big problem because i'm not like no where's my money where's my money no that's okay but i didn't like when it was me Mm-hmm. 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 So she refers this person, tells me, really important person to me. Please like do all the extras if you can. All the extras is like here, let's put on a show. What show do you like watching? I'll put it down to like the season and episode for you if you want. Make you a little cabecito. When you come and do it, get your makeup done by me, you're my bestie. I'm gonna make sure you're taken care of real good. Mm -hmm -hmm. Mm -hmm -hmm. So, take her person, super sweet. 
put on some Netflix for her down to the episode, down to the season, down to the minute. Cool. She kept having her little comments here and there. Oh, bacteria doesn't do that for me. You're so sweet. You're so nice. Bacteria would have charged extra. This and that. I was like, well, we have different prices for different things. You know, I wasn't gonna let her talk about bacteria like that. I was like, no. Bacteria is bacteria that, right? I finish her makeup and she starts taking down her hair. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, that's something bacteria does that you don't do. But like, attitude. I was like, well, I guess so. I guess so. Mm. It was the first time I've liked how the corn actually came out. The sausage though, they didn't even cook that. <clears throat> they just sliced it in and threw it in last minute, I bet. She still has her hair down and I'm like, okay, well, this is the total. And she's like, well, is it gonna be half of that? And I was like, why would it be half of that? Because bacteria does my hair. And I was like, okay, well, I don't do hair. And we should have discussed that before. We should have discussed that before. That was like a oopsie, oopsie poopsie on me. And I was like, oh, one sec. So I messaged bacteria and I'm like, hey, do you do hair? Because last I checked, it's only on occasions, like for geenses and weddings, you know, but it wasn't like her everyday makeup thing. She says, no. And if you do her hair, that's on you. So I was like, ew, she's getting a little snappy. So I was gonna like start writing her like, what? Like, ew, why are you writing me like that? And she's like, sorry, really busy, but no, I don't do her hair. She just tries to slide it in. I'm like, oh, okay. So I tell her, I'm like, oh, I just got done talking to, I keep wanting to say her name, bacteria. And she says, no that she doesn't and that she charges extra and this is something that you do and like kind of laughing with her and not saying you're rude you know and she's like well can you now her hair is thick like super thick like hella extension stick and i tell her yeah but it's an extra charge and she's like yeah i'll pay you the full amount that's my price that I charge, bacteria is like $15 more than me. No, like that's what, so I didn't like how she was like, oh yeah, I'll pay you the full amount, but my hair included. I didn't like how she did that. I was like, no, you're gonna pay that amount plus more for me doing your hair. Now she kept like making jokes and she was funny. You know, she she's like good, good, nice vibes, but a little feisty. You know, one of those where you're like, you don't wanna be too mean, but then you're like, oh, you kind of feel bad. Kind of, you know, kind of like, vibes mm. Mm -hmm -hmm. so she had like a really strong strong personality kind of like my prima and it's like you never know it can be like no like i mean it and then like i'm just joking you know so it's like you never you never know what way it's gonna swing you know and so i tell her I'll do your hair, but this is the price that I charge, okay? This is the price that I charge, and then I'll charge an extra 15 for your hair. <sighs> she stares at me for a long minute. And mind you, I made her cafecito, which is no problem. Made her cafecito, got her a Coke, got her a donut. I'm, I'm being real nice, you know what I'm saying? Where I'm like, and you guys are like, oh my God, it's not a big deal, okay? But it was nice, you know what I mean? I was being nice. And her show, she didn't want to finish watching all of it because she didn't want to watch the whole thing without her husband, so we... Had to stop, put on a different one. She didn't like one of the palettes that I was using. So she was like, can we use another palette? Do you by chance have this palette? Of course, same result, different palette. And it's fine. She wanted to hold the mirror in her face the whole time. That's fine. I wanted to take a, a couple phone calls where I had to sit there for a minute. That's fine. That's fine. I was trying to be nice with bacteria since this person was really important to her. She says, Okay, fine. You got me. You got me. I was just trying to see if I could get a little discount. <sighs> now that irks me. Because if she would have just played her cards right, I would have just been like more than happy to do it. Fine. Cool. Whatever. So as I'm doing her hair, she's talking to me about some face concerns that she has. Scarring on her face. Asking me if I know a product that will work. That bacteria told her that I love that sort of thing and I'd love to foundation match, which I do. I love to foundation match. 
in person. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm. When you don't see the person face to face, it's hard because your picture can be a different settings than mine. And it's just really hard. The filters, all that, you know? So I don't really, I sometimes do, but it's hard because then someone will be like, uh, this is not match me at all. And then someone else will be like, oh my God, this was a perfect match. Thank you so much. So it's kind of like mm, gambling, you know? So I tell him like, yeah. And she's like, oh, you should like match me. I would really appreciate it. And I was like, yeah, you know what? Yeah, I can, I can do that. I can do that. Cause we're like now talking and she has thick hair. <sighs> it took a hot ass Netflix movie. Okay, hot ass Netflix movie. And she had to go to the restroom and she took a little while. So that took some time too. Mm. As we're talking, I get a message it's from bacteria. Material tells me, don't let her try to add discounts. <clears throat> so I'm like, okay, got it. Noted. So we finish her hair. We start going through my beauty products. And I'm telling her about like, oh, this is some really good scarring cream. I like the Derma E scar gel. It's really, really good. If you guys have acne scars, really, really good. Make sure you're consistent with it and make sure you're pairing it with an SPF. Yeah, look at that, look at that, look at that. <laughs> Professional. She's telling me like, oh, okay, okay, okay. She has it in her hand, the one that like I use. So I see her holding on to it and I'm like, okay. Can you shade match me? I was like, oh yeah, 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 yeah. I use this shade on you. This one is gonna be good for, you know, it goes with this one, this one will be perfect, the undertone, all of that. You like the matte finish. You don't gotta set up with a powder. You'll be all right, you'll be good. You can use it with this primer, this primer, this primer. Make sure that you, you know, use this type of moisturizer. Give me the whole nine yards and she's just writing her little notepad in her phone. Mm. I hold out the foundation, I'm like, this is it. You know, if you want to take a picture. She's like, yeah, hold on to it. So now she has the, the scar gel and then a foundation. And I'm like, okay, all right. Sticky fingers over here. Okay, cheers. Uh, my beauty room, trying to say this as humbly as possible, is really, really cool. Okay, like really, really cool. I love it. She sees one of my Steve Madden bags. If you guys don't know, I do shop for FanBam. They pay for the shipping and there is a finder's fee. Not a big one, but I will go out and, you know, get some good stuff. I do it here and there. I do have two horrible sore times on that because it was just so stressful because sometimes FanBam, there's some fake FanBam. And I feel like it sometimes just ruins it for everybody. You know what I mean? She looks out and see Maddie bags. Oh, I've been looking for one. How did you find them? Mm -hmm. Mm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I tell her like, oh, I wanted this spot and that spot. Had my babe take me here, take me there. One by myself, this, that, that. Mm-mm. I don't got time for all that. I got things to do with my day. Okay. It's all in the way you say it. You know what I mean? It's all in the way you say it. And so she asked me, do you have any extras by chance? And I was like, oh yeah, I do. I have a pink one, black one, and then two green, I believe. Yeah, two green. She asks me, oh, how much? Who wanted that? So anyway, she asked me, I said 40. She said, girl, you undercharge yourself. Especially earlier when I was trying to get a for price, you were just gonna let me. 40? No, you're not even making a profit. I was like, well, it's a little profit. And she's like, mm-mm, do better. Tell me why after that speech, <clears throat> she tells me, I'll take two and, I'll, and I'm and I'm gonna flip them. I said no. She's like, "Well, cause what I just said, you gotta be able to take criticism, baby." I was like, "Nah, these are on hold." I didn't like how she said it. I I just didn't. She has such a strong personality, but she's so nice at the same time. It was so confusing. It was like I was talking to my grandma. I was like, mm, mm. and she was not that much older than me. So I was like, "What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you?" And she kept saying, "You got such an old soul." No, bitch. You got an old soul. The fuck? Uh, like, what the hell? Anyways, so 
she goes on to ask me what is some good skincare. I tell her like, oh, okay, you know, with her like her skin and stuff like that. Here's drunk um, drunk elephant. I'm really obsessed. This is what I use. I have a bunch of empty the empties. Mm. And I tell her like, this is how much I love the product. This is a lot of. This is how much I like it. This and that. Okay. She holds on to the bottle. She holds on to the moisturizer. She holds on to the concealer. Might as well get her a fucking basket at this point. I'm telling her, I'm like, oh, you can put it right there. My my table. No, it's fine. I was like, okay, well, if you need help taking some pictures, like, I can help you. No, it's fine. I'm like, oh. And I felt so awkward. Texting my friend, like, hey, like, I think she's trying to leave with, like, the products that, like, I'm showing her and stuff like that. She said, she's strong-headed, girl. Don't let her leave with the products. Put your foot down. Don't let her walk over you. Thank you. She's strong headed. She's always trying to take my stuff. Don't let her. She's just trying to see what she can get away with. And I'm just like, why wouldn't you tell me this all from the jump? So I'm annoyed because I'm like, why wouldn't you tell me this from the beginning? Difficult per difficult customer. X, Y, and Z, X, Y, and Z. But it's because she knows this. And I hate that. And I always try to be as respectable as possible. All the time. But no. She was like testing my patience. And the whole time I was like, am I being fucking punk right now? Like, mm. And I've like, I've had people like this in my life. And I'm like, why do y'all talk like that? Like, is it because like your mama didn't like pop you in the one, in like in the mouth? Like, did nobody like humble you? Like, what the and anytime I would get like a little sass back, she'd be like, okay then, like that. <sighs> okay. Okay. Now, I didn't have makeup on when I did her makeup. So there is sometimes where I do have my makeup done, and sometimes I don't. Especially because I feel like sometimes when you do a client's makeup, some clients, okay, not all, will, will wonder why something sits different on your face versus their face even though we did the same steps but everyone has different texture different things you know stuff like that and a color might pop differently on you than it does on me you know and i had a friend who did my makeup one time and i asked her like how come you don't wear makeup like girl you know you get down she told me so there's no comparison since for so the uh, client feels more comfortable and i was like all right bet took a page out of her book and i was like all right i'm gonna i'm gonna do that i'm gonna do that because there is sometimes where like me and like clients will go have like a little back and forth we're like well why this well, why, well how can we use that foundation and you didn't use that foundation on me because i got combination skin and you got dry skin that's why you know and it's a little back and forth sometimes some people get offended or some people might be like well how can you use that moisturizer on you and not me and it's like Girl, it is still a high-end moisturizer. What are you talking about? Some people don't know all the name high-end brands, so they'll just assume like, oh, so you use Junk Elephant on me, and you use Lancome on me, and they're like, they think since Lancome and L'Oreal are sister companies, that it's not as good, and it's like, yes, it is. What are you talking about? So it's like a back and forth, back and forth. So there is sometimes I don't put on a lot of makeup, and there's sometimes I just go bare, naked, bare face. You know what I'm saying? Ugh, why are you looking at that? It's like freaking me out. I'm gonna turn you that way. I'm gonna eat you from behind. <laughs> Stupid. Anyways, so I'm like kind of like annoyed looking at my phone, and we didn't name the client mushroom because she really was a little dickhead okay she was like uh is everything okay and i was like oh yeah everything's fine i'm just talking to bacteria she's asking me how everything's going oh i'm like what she's she always does that okay so she's like holding on to like the thing still asking me what lashes would be good for like her eye shape Salon Perfect has a good line for different eye shapes. Bust those out, show her. Since you have a more almond shape, this one would be really perfect. She grabs two of them. So, I don't play by my lashes, baby. I don't. I don't. Mm -mm, mm -mm. And I was like, what are you doing? What do you mean? Yeah, what are you doing? What do you mean? What are you doing? Are you going to sell my stuff? No, you're giving it to me. I don't know what get, mm -mm. I, I don't, I don't know what it, what in how I implied that, no, I'm not. What do you mean? 
no what do you mean i think that's my line like no what what do you mean so it was kind of awkward to the point i was getting kind of scared because i was like do i have to calm my babe down like does my my bodyguard husband have to come in here because of what i was confused i was like audacity on mushroom okay so she puts the stuff down and i feel so bad because instantly she makes like a so i was like oh, okay she real confused she real confused okay <sighs> let me collect myself real quick because i know i can have a pito face like a mother okay so i was like i'm sorry i know my collection is very beautiful but i'm sorry if i am if i implied that but i was just showing you the products i i I'm so sorry. Maybe I did say, oh, like I, I have an extra. I don't remember me saying that, but if I did, I am so sorry. Sometimes I get caught up in conversation and she's like, no, 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 you didn't. I just thought you were showing me the products because bacteria says you give freebies. And I was like, oh, I don't know why she does that. It makes things so uncomfortable. She starts laughing. We're like him and hawing about it because there has been times where bacteria will send somebody, oh yeah, they're like, she'll, like, she'll throw in this, she'll throw in that. Don't do that. That's so rude. Don't ever set up a friend, a cousin, a sister, anybody like that. Like it's so awkward, especially if they see like my giveaway bin. Now I'm more than happy to give. Always ask my neighbors, ask my friends. Ask my family, ask my fam bam. I'm more than happy to give. I love it, but I don't like it when someone else wants to, you know, be like, oh yeah, do it. It's weird. It won't, I won't give the person the same energy because now it just feels like it's tainted energy. I don't know, maybe it's just me overthinking it, but that's how I feel. So other times people will literally wait by the giveaway bin and I'm like, okay, bye. And they'll just wait and I'm like, did you need something else? Like, oh, I was just, um, do I just grab a couple of the things right here? I'm like, what are you talking about? So awkward. If you want more of those story times, let me know. So me and my friend get to talking and I'm like, I'm so sorry that she did that. I'm currently doing a couple giveaways i would have offered you some of the giveaway products but where i'm doing a couple giveaways that's why like it didn't come to my mind because some of the things are already marked out and if you pick something it's like a whole like thing right because at times i used to do palette 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 if i have brushes 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 skincare 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 so if a client comes in and is like oh i want to take like you know some of the th it makes sense to me i don't know maybe i'm overthinking it so we get to talking and she tells me like well do you have any extra of this scar gel i was like you know what let me check because she went on her phone she said that the scar gel was a little bit more expensive than the other products that she was holding i was like let me check i look yes i do yes i do i do <laughs> i do i give it to her i know some of you are gonna be like oh my god jay why do you do that One, I wanted to, and two, I felt kind of bad and I felt kind of awkward, you know what I mean? And it's like, if I can give it, I'm gonna give it. Now tell me why both my kids in the back fall, scrape their knee, and they're like, oh, mom, you're gonna have to share some of that scar gel. Cause when we removed one of Elijah's things that he had in his cabeza, scar gel, that thing worked amazing, my baby. So they're all like scar gel, you know? So I was like, <laughs> anyways, so. I give her her scar gel. She pays me. She's excited. She goes on her merry way. Later that night. Bacteria calls me. Hey girl, how did it go? And she's like kind of laughing like, girl, I know you're mad. I know you're mad. And that irritates me. Because I'm just like, why do you think that's funny? I like, guess it's not funny. But... Sometimes friends will be like, oh, you take this too seriously. It's not that deep. Don't let it, don't let it ruin your day. Don't get so mad. Yada, yada, yada. So uh, I tell her, she tells me, thank you so much for taking care of her. It was her cousin's sister-in-law and she was so happy and she like pretty much was like bragging about me in the church and was like, she does really good makeup, you guys. And I was like, oh, heck yeah. 
you might get more clients now and i'm like oh no like it's okay it's like you know when i can and stuff because y'all i get like so nervous where i feel like am i sweating too much am i this too much and then sometimes i'll get into such a good groove and i'll be like 10 clients and like yeah like we're gonna do this i think it's just me i psych myself out way too much and get my head to it too much much so we're talking and she's like what'd you throw in there she was hecka bragging about it and then you hooked her up and i was like oh some scar gel girl that's it that's it and i was telling her like the whole thing and stuff like that and she was like man I, I i thought you were gonna hook her up i should have let you know beforehand like i thought you were gonna make me look real good real good and i'm like okay like my bad like i thought i like okay it, it felt weird you know i was like you hook her up bitch you get pr like why don't you bitch you know i come from my big family Tambien, pendeja, tambien. What are you talking about? I get a new client. We will call her shrimp. Okay, shrimp's like, hey, I heard from, I heard about you from mushroom. Mushroom told me they did such a good job. Can I book you? And I said yes, but I only do makeup. I don't do hair. She puts it back laughing. Yeah, she told me about that. That's hilarious. I didn't find it hilarious, but I don't know. Sometimes I guess I can be funny without knowing. So. Tell her, yeah, of course, this is the day that these are the days I'm available. When is it that you need? Okay, she worked with that day. Okay, cool. Date night. Comes over, do her makeup. It's a fun time. It's great. She asks me, oh, what's that bin? I said, oh, that's my giveaway bin. My makeup giveaway bin. Oh, so after I'm done, do I get a freebie? And I'm like, oh, yeah, sure. Yeah. Oh, that's so awesome. I love that you do that. And we start talking back and forth. I'm like, oh, yeah, great. Okay, I get another client. We'll call her Corn. Hey, Heard about you from shrimp and mushroom. They loved your services. Was wondering if I could do hair and makeup. I said my specialty is not hair. I could do curls and I could straighten your hair, but I can't do updos. That's fine. I just want someone to curl my hair. I don't like how my curls come out. <laughs> Perfect. I could do that. Okay, cool. Comes to her hair. She was really sweet. This is where it happens with corn. Corn was really sweet. She tells me, so how are you in Bacteria Friends? And I was like, oh, through Facebook, we were part of a makeup group. We would like comment on each other's things all the time. And it just literally just happened that way. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. I was like, yeah, you're so nice. And I was like, oh, thank you. Thank you very much. And she's like, yeah, I didn't, I wouldn't think that you guys would be friends. Like that's crazy. Like opposites do attract. And I was like, uh, I think we're kind of much similar on the same with like, you know, like the bitch face attitude, that kind of thing. And she's like, mm, yeah, sure, 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 sure. She asked me if I have talked to Mushroom lately. I'm like, no, not really. Mushroom will be like sometimes in the comments, sometimes like a picture and stuff like that. But no, I haven't really talked to her. She's like, oh, well, you'll probably be hearing her for, from her soon. We have an event coming up. And I was like, oh, cool. That's cool. Wait, I think she'll be going back with bacteria though. She's like, mm, I don't know. I was like, okay. Corn leaves. Okay, cool. Some time passes by, right? Main bacteria are talking here and there, but she's a little bit more short with me, like short. And I should be posting like into windows. Like, oh, don't you hate when you ask for a favor and it's not done all the way, like how you would have done it. And I don't think it's for me because the shoe does not fit, bitch. And I'm not going to make it fit. So I reply like a hundred, yup, yeah. Cause how am I supposed to know that we have a problem if you don't tell me that we have a problem? I'm not just gonna assume that we have a problem because I'm not gonna take the comments as an attack, okay? I'm not gonna be like, oh, that was to me, that was to me. Especially if I know my heart's of hearts that I didn't do nothing shady at all, okay? I moved accordingly. So, she then posts something, uh, I'm not doing any more referrals or anything like that. The love never comes back reciprocated, da 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 So then I get curious. because so I was like, maybe this boot wants to fit, maybe. So I was like, who are we talking about? She just replies, I said, no, who are we talking about? Because I know it's not me, right? Because I send you referrals. Sometimes people don't even come back to me. Like X, Y, and Z, da 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 So who are we talking about? Because now I feel like, okay, this is like, hmm. And sometimes your soldiers sometimes just speak to you sometimes, right? She goes, oh, yeah, I forgot about that. It's been so long. And I said, yeah, that should tell you. They've been long clients now. You're welcome, bitch. It looked like a laughing face with like a heart, you know, kissy face, kissy face. So then we start talking back normal again. So I was like, okay, that's weird. So like there was some like weird animosity and then I broke it because it was like, uh, I remember this. Then it was like, oh yeah, I'm so sorry. You're right, you're right. Okay, so Mushrooms hits me back up. 
okay girl do you have availability for this day we're gonna have an event and i was like oh yeah because like okay yeah yeah she had, okay i'm already thinking about the conversation i had like a while ago right so i'm like oh okay yeah so i tell her i'm like yeah is bacteria busy question mark and she said yep with a smiley face now i didn't want to be a little instigator and write bacteria because i was like okay this is weird i'd rather just get it out of mushroom so i said i don't want to become i don't want to come between you two this isn't something I do all the time, so I'm not gonna really be dependable as a makeup artist like Bacteria would. She says, that's fine. Smiley face. <sighs> okay, so I messaged Bacteria. I'm like, hey girl, Mushroom wants to book with me again. Are you gonna be cool with that? I don't want it to be weird or anything like that. I did let her know that I'm not gonna be a reliable makeup artist because this is not like my full-time job and that you'll be more reliable. I showed her and everything. She says, that's fine. Period, 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 period. What are we thinking about so long? Let me know what we're thinking about right now, please. Okay, Mushroom comes, super excited. She has a little guest with her and I'm like, oh, because you didn't tell me. <laughs> and I just, you know, it's fine, whatever. So but the reason why I'm bringing, you'll, you'll see why. So she has a little guest for her. And I was like, oh, hi, no problem, it's fine. I would just like to know, and I'm not, in the makeup game like this where i have like a full like thing like hey don't be late hey this hey that hey that because i'm telling y'all i don't do it like how i used to not because i don't want to it's just because like i swear with age my anxiety has been going crazy and i'm like trying to i'm trying all these like natural herbs <sighs> these drinks that are really gross where supposedly like you're supposed to flush everything i'm trying okay vitamins all the time like i'm really trying and but i feel like once i get back in the groove we will all, we'll all be like, who many hind, right? I tell her, we're only doing your makeup right because we didn't say nothing about her. Well, if you want to be nice, I would appreciate that. But if it's going to be an issue, then no. Again, the sassiness. And I was like, yep, it is definitely going to be an issue. So let me know right now if I, you want me to go further. Okay, girl. No, it'll be fine. So it's so hard. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, okay. So I'm like doing her makeup and stuff like that. We're like talking, put on her Netflix. She's chilling. Look, cabecito. She's good doing all of it, right? Bacteria gets brought up into this conversation. She goes, so you really went out of your way to write her and let her know I was going to book with you? And I was like, yeah, because you normally go to her and I didn't want any weird animosity or anything like that. And I didn't want to step on anyone's toes. She said, I can respect that. That's what I like about you, Alexis. When people say that, they usually come with a little, you know? And I was like, oh, yeah? Mm, thank you. She goes, yeah. Especially because that girl don't like you at all. Mmm, okay. I was like, oh, really now? So I'm like doing her makeup. The little girl wants to chime in. Yeah, at all. <laughs> I said, really now? <laughs> okay, my feelings are getting hurt, guys. So I'm doing her makeup, and I don't even really ask questions. I just keep it cute. And she's like, oh, did I hurt your feelings? Like, it's clear as day. And I'm like, no, it's fine. I was like, it's not really, obviously, if I didn't see it. <laughs> So she laughs, she tells me I'm funny. Do her makeup. She says, thank you so much for taking shrimp and corn. She really appreciates it. And that was really nice and stuff like that, especially because of the whole like giveaway bin. But that she was wondering if corn did something wrong because corn didn't give, get a giveaway thing, a give a makeup item. I was like, oh no, she didn't do anything wrong at all. I was like, we were just talking, everything was fine and she left. And the makeup, my makeup giveaway pile is like form like my fam bam because of like my videos and stuff. They show support, they show love, and I really do appreciate it. And she said, well, am I not supporting you? And I said, did you not get scarred out? So and it, it's kind of, it's so sticky, it's so hard, you know, with the, the whole conversation, it's, it's just hard. So maybe if you guys can help me with the words that I should have used, I would appreciate it. So we continue to talk and I was like, yeah, Corn didn't do anything wrong. She was like, well, maybe I just take her a little gift. And I was like, well, maybe not. <laughs> Cause now it just feels weird, you know? And she just starts laughing. Okay, it's fine. Well. Hopefully you can take us again. We're gonna have another event coming up and I would, you know, really appreciate it. And I said, oh yeah, probably not anytime for the next like couple of months, especially cause like I'm gonna be doing X, Y, and Z. Okay, that's fine. Maybe, you know, let bacteria know. And if not, do you know anybody? And I was like, uh, I can, I can definitely see. I can definitely see. You're so sweet, especially knowing that bacteria don't even like you like that. I'm like, okay, <laughs> I left it at that. She tried to get a little giveaway, little makeup item, it didn't feel right. And so like, it kind of like shooed her, you know what I'm saying? The little girl liked uh, one of the lip glosses that I had in the giveaway. Yeah, go ahead, grab it. No biggie, no problem. 
Okay, bye. Some time passes and I am on Facebook. They're chilling on Facebook. Bacteria posts that she needs a date night. She wants to be able to like let loose. Does anyone else's husband not spontaneous and just take them out? I swear me and so-and-so had been together for so long and you think that he doesn't even know that I like this and I don't like that. Like I know his loving language going off, going a mile a minute on her husband. Now before I would like comment all the time and be like, girl, yeah, like, you know, no one would say nothing. He would never say anything. He was just like, ha ha ha, laugh about it. You know I love you, get ready, da 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 da, ha 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 ha, right? So I comment, girl, you deserve it. You you work really hard. Just tell your mans and I'm sure he'll take you, babe. Everyone else was saying the same thing. Some people were even bashing him. Like, girl, how many times are you gonna complain about this man and yet still spend another year with him? Shut up. Girl, take yourself to the movies. Girl, da 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 da. But mine stood out, I guess, to him for some odd reason she don't even like you Lex now she probably thought she deleted it quick enough where I couldn't see it but I saw it I felt so awkward I was like what <laughs> like huh like I felt like what what do you mean by that <laughs> what do you mean by that because now Mushroom's saying it and now he's saying it. So like obviously you feel some type of way and you're over here talking about me in the church. Like what? Like Jesus, did she say something? Like you know what I'm saying? So I go back to reply what and his comment's not there no more. I'm like what the? So I messaged her and I was like hey I seen what so and so bro. Like what's good? What's up? Like are you feeling some type of way about something that I don't know about? Like you need to let me know. Like I don't know what's going on. She says nothing. He was just being silly. He was just being silly. And I'm like, okay, are you sure? Like, are we good? Like, I like would like to fix it if we're not. Yeah, we're good, Lex. And I'm like, okay. Some time passes by and we still are not like really like talking. And I'm kind of like, what the heck? Like, what's, what's going on? Corn asks me like, hey, would you be available just to do my hair? Not makeup, just hair, quick in and out. Mushroom really, really liked her hair when you curled it. Look what my baby made me. These look good. I didn't quarantine hair or having a good conversation. I said, oh, by the way, Bacteria told me that you mentioned to her that you didn't get anything from the giveaway bin. Oh my gosh, it wasn't even like that. How'd she say it? So I told her. No, she was asking what me got. And I said, what did you guys get? I said what they got. And I said, oh no, I didn't get anything. The conversation was great. She was great. I didn't need anything. Moved on with my day. I was like, okay, well, I know I don't have to explain, but I would like to explain how my giveaway bin works. I told her about it. She said that's fantastic, especially because I don't f I don't watch your content. I don't follow your content. I don't follow you online. I just heard you because of word of mouth. It's fine. I understand that. I said okay, great. She said don't even feel like you need to give me anything because I know bitch come off a little bit. Son of a bitch. I know mushroom can come off a little strong, but I don't need anything. That's fine. This is what you're coming for. I, it's like going to the store and expecting samples all the time. You're no Sephora. I said, yeah, exactly. You get it. Okay, great. Later on, I get a uh, message from Mushroom. She tells me, girl, you didn't need to tell her all of that. And I said, well, how did you hear it? Because this telephone thing is going kind of crazy. And this is why I like to keep to me, myself, and I. Because we get along just great. <laughs> she tells me, she didn't say that you were talking anything like that she said it like this and i said yep that's exactly how i said it she said well i just thought it would be nice that you'd give her something she's went to you twice already and i said this is not why i do makeup to give out the makeup products if that's why you guys are booking with me i'm sorry no it's just fun something to look forward to like a little treat i said i completely i completely can understand that me and my friend are out who is fan bam we are out we're shopping we're having fun it's good and i see bacteria bacteria is sitting down and she is having lunch with her husband and the babies. I see her just like any other times I have seen her, 
hey bacteria hey girl hey so and so hey guys hugs how you doing little picture little something hey you know something spoke in my ear don't go up there don't go up there but i was like maybe that's just my anxiety like maybe just anxiety is talking and i'm just like tripping out right so i go to bacteria her husband sees and he kind of just like hey lex like that i was like hey bacteria she don't even get up to like greet me i bend down and give her a hug and i was like hey what are you guys doing same thing you're doing i was like oh okay hey guys you know her husband, her husband is the one who is making the more, like the, the effort in the conversation with me. I take the hint. Okay, well, I hope you guys have a great evening. <laughs> I walk off. My friend, fam bam, girl, that is not your friend. She does not like you. You could see her face of dread when you walked over. She does not want to talk to you. She does not want to be in your presence. She does not like you. No, 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 your aura is way too strong for her. I said, damn, bitch. Okay, I get it. Like, she don't like me. I said, you really got all that? She's like, yeah, something. So she laid it on pretty thick and it like really hurt my feelings. And I was like, mm, this feels so awkward. Like, I want to know. So I took it to some more friends. <laughs> Put my friends in a little chat and I was like, okay, I need y'all to let me know if I do something without me knowing and i need to know if it could have bothered bacteria one of my friends was like i'm sure it's not nothing anything maybe her her and her hubby were fighting you walk in the wrong time valid too maybe she's upset about the corn shrimp and mushroom situation she didn't think that they're gonna want to go with you she lost her clients pretty sure it hurts okay third sometimes lex your anxiety could kind of get too much valid i get it other one i don't see a problem just ask her forward hey what's up other friend she did not like you i was like okay cool got it so i wrote bacteria a long length lengthy message and i was like hey girl i know you say that there's nothing wrong i feel it your man's even you know was trying to like get the conversation go i want to know so like i can either stop reaching out because it's too much i used to have a long time friend where i was always the one reaching out sometimes people just outgrow with each other there does not have to be no beef i was the friend that was constantly like reaching out reaching out because I really adored this friendship. Like it was something really like pure to me. I loved it and we just outgrew each other. I kept messaging, messaging, messaging. Sometimes it would take days, sometimes it would take months for a reply. So then I just was like, you know, I'm just gonna stop entirely. And it just stopped. We didn't have no beef, there was no nothing, still got love for them, perfect. So I let her know if that's what that is, if this is like, if we're outgrowing each other, that's cool. I just want to know and I will like leave you alone. I just want to know if I did something to hurt your feelings, I would like really appreciate you telling me so I can correct my wrongs if I can or explain myself. You know what I'm saying? She said that she didn't appreciate how I didn't turn down mushroom for the second time or the third and how I took shrimp and corn. And I said, okay, well, I didn't know from the jump that shrimp and corn were from her. I told her like, even when I told her like, I wasn't gonna be a reliable makeup, I asked you. She was like, yeah, but I just wanted you to say no. And then when I told you to take care of her, you didn't like hook her up like I thought you were gonna hook her up. And I just feel like kind of weird. And I'm like, wait, like I was just so confused. And so I was like, oh, okay, well, I don't appreciate how you just assume just cause I have a makeup, I have a makeup giveaway bin that like it's just freebies for whoever you send or you know and then you said like a bag like it makes things awkward and i don't appreciate that because i don't send anybody that i recommend to you oh hey and she gets down with the hair make sure this make sure that i don't put you in situations like that she said okay yeah i could get that if you get your makeup for free why can't you just give it to why couldn't you just hook them up i sat there and explained myself and i said you know i can see that point i can see your point of view i get it but i feel like my fam bam deserve it more i feel like my fam bam is top priority and she said well that's why i can't agree with you on that and i said that's fine we don't have to see eye to eye on a lot because a friendship where you constantly are seeing like eye to eye on everything it's just like eh, it's like you know what i mean okay great that's fine and so i was like can we address the comment that your husband made 
And she said, yeah, I was upset. I was venting to him about it. He said it was pretty messed up. He got in my head about it. And I, I was talking about you, blah, blah, blah. And I said, okay, cool. That's great. Love that. Because I'm not going to sit here and be a liar and be like, oh, yeah, I don't vent to my babe or tell my babe the cheese is or this and that. I'm not going to sit there and do that. He was wrong for going against his wife and putting the business out there. To me, mm -mm, not very team player of you, okay? So she was like, I apologize. Can I ask you not to take mushroom, corn, and shrimp? And I said, no, just kidding. No, I was like, uh, it's not gonna work out anyways. Not gonna be able to do it for the next couple months. I'm pretty sure she understood. She said, okay, great. I thought we hashed it. I thought it was good. I thought it was better. Okay, cool. We said that like, oh, you know, I got love for you. Da, 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 da. Time passes. She writes me, hey Lex. Now when I get those messages, my soul already knows something's up. I said, what's up, girl? Are you still taking mushroom? And I said, nope, not at all. So she screenshots mushrooms makeup, the guy that got done by somebody. She didn't tag the person. She just said, I feel so good, da, da, da. She said, this is like kind of like your work. And I said, no, it's not. <laughs> That's not me. I'm telling you I didn't do it. She said, are you sure? With like the eyes. Yes, I'm sure. Like I know I'm not a little scared cat, especially like, no. She's like, okay. I said, why don't you just ask her? Bet. So she asks Mushroom. Mushroom says somebody else, which is a mutual of ours. So she says the mutual, she writes me back. She tells me and I'm like, oh, that's cool. She's like, no, not cool, Lex. Like I was expecting that money. And I was like, oh, sorry. Like, I don't know what to say. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, like that's like really crappy, very shitty. Like I get it, you know, but Mm. so i'm like why do you think that she went with the mutual and she's like i don't know i feel like i did something wrong so shrimp and corn are still going to bacteria so corn lets it slip and was like i didn't like how you were sitting here pretty much like running her mouth like running her mouth talking bad about people that she talked bad about you know this person what makes you think you want to talk bad about me da -da 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 -da. had nothing to do with me so bacteria writes me like it wasn't even about you i guess she feels some way because i said something about this person this person i'm just like like that's just too much drama. like you see girl this is why i don't i don't like mm -mm, it's too much for me uh -uh. so anyways we leave it at that she's kind of like oh my gosh dang that's crazy and i'm like i know like hmm oh well you know you lose them you win some you lose some fast forward again my cousin is doing soccer okay because he's doing soccer, having a great old time. It's co-ed. So boys and girls play. Men and women. They play together. Bacterial's husband is on the team. I don't know how it came about or what. I don't know if it's because I was like there to pick her up. I don't know what it was. He says, my wife's a bitch. You should tell her that I meant what I said to me when I replied back to her comment, she doesn't like her. They're like laughing about the situation cause she's like, I feel uncomfortable. Like, why are you telling me this? He's like, not a good person. Cause like lots of reasons, whatever. And he's like, yeah, you should tell your cousin. She's like, okay, she gets in the car. I was like, how you know him? Because I'm already thinking like, you better not be messing with him because now I gotta tell bacteria and that's gonna be real awkward. She goes, you know, his wife doesn't like you. I was like, what? Do you know his wife? I was like, no, trying to hella play it off. She's like, well, he said that he meant what he said when he commented on the post. And I was like, interesting, very interesting. Time passes. <laughs> I tell my cousin, tell her mans to tell her. I know the truth. Tell me why we haven't talked since. Tell me why we haven't talked since. Yeah, that is how her husband ruined our friendship. Just kidding. It is what it is. It's cool. At the end of the day, I know that like, literally like i didn't i don't know y'all let me know like yeah that was messed up like it was free i could see it from both points but i just feel like what the fuck? i feel like it was just like a reason to be upset and who knows like i i don't know that's the way the cookie crumbles fortunately there was no ass beaten there was no nada just kidding but no it's just like it is what it is like it's it's cool it's fine obviously it was more than like cheese miss with your husband if like he is like no tell her because my wife's a bitch you know what i mean and it's just like that is so awkward so awkward because it was just i don't know but it's just like we weren't like besties or nothing like that we weren't like oh my god we get each other like gifts and shit for like holidays and stuff like that like christmas and stuff it's just cool i just didn't like I, like yo i wrote you 
took the time to like reach out and be like, let me correct my wrongs if I, if I did any wronging, you know what I mean? Nada. So let me know if you've been in a certain similar situation like that and where you're just left like, what the b Huh? You know what I mean? Like, cause what? You know? And I get the whole outgrowing. I get the whole like, I don't agree with this and that. I get the whole like this, 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 you know? It was just like weird. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed today's mukbang and story time. I haven't done one in a long time. When was the last time I did a mukbang? Like a very long time. I love you guys so, 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 so much. Best of those. I hope you guys enjoyed the long story time. And let me know what you guys want to see more of. More nanny series, more side stories. I know you guys say makeup tutorials, but honestly, y'all, when I do post a makeup tutorial, uh, some of you, you guys don't seem like interested in that form of content no more. You know what I'm saying? But let me know. I would love to know and try to like incorporate it in some way. I love you guys. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. Bye.